Welcome to TED 2024 Congress here in Scottsdale, Arizona. I have the distinct pleasure of having a really important guest at this meeting. He participated in one of the best sessions we've had at this Congress called the Innovations Session. This is Dr. Cameron Sarakar. Uh, by training, he's a physician and a neurosurgeon, but now he's got involved in a very important unmet need that he is working on. Can you tell me something about it? Yeah. Um, what's missing is the connection of the implants that we're putting in um, into patients uh, with all the players uh, along the line of the life of an implant. So we've heard a lot of incredible uh, technology stories um, as well as procedural stories over the last couple of days at this conference, which has been amazing. Uh, but it really represents a very small portion of the life uh, of a device that we insert into uh, So what patient. you mean to say is, there are so many implants being put into the human body. I'm a vascular surgeon. I put in a lot of thoracic and abdominal endografts. And the, the, the guidelines state that these endografts have to be followed for the rest of the patient's life or the life of the device. Yeah, and that's and true. Right and yeah. right now, we are not really doing a good job at it. No. How do um, you make it better? And tell me a few things about this company that was founded called MedTrack. Yeah, MedTrack, um, the objective is to track the medical devices throughout their lifetime of the device. And that's what I was getting to is that um, really what we're looking for is to be able to see where every device is um, for the lifetime of the device, for the lifetime of the patient. And the key here is not to have uh, a top-down approach to tracking these devices, but rather from the patient up. Um, so the patient is at the center of this. Exactly correct, yeah. Um, so it's a, it's a method of uh, tracking devices that is really a cross-platform. It's not unique to one particular health record or one insurance uh, or one vendor, but rather really goes across platform. The other thing also is there are a lot of other factors involved, such as the industry or the manufacturer. Do they play a role? The patient definitely is at the center of this, the physicians, the hospitals, uh, so uh, the medical records, CMS. So there's so many moving parts. So does MedTrack bring all of that together? Uh, yes, MedTrack brings all those things together, manufacturers, uh, all of industry, uh, institutions, physicians, and of course, at the center of it, however, is the patient. Excellent. Um, uh, and yes, um, there's uh, even a way of um, really um, solidifying the information by connecting with, uh, for example, uh, FDA warnings and recalls um, that will alert the patient and everyone along the line of the lifetime of the device um, uh, about things like device warnings, new techniques, um, recalls, etc. That is definitely an unmet need uh, in the follow-up of implantable devices that need to be tracked and followed up so as to catch deficiencies or complications early. Congratulations. Thank you, my Cameron, pleasure. For this company called Metrack, and you can look it up. Uh, and hopefully, we'll see you again next year uh, with further developments and implementation of this unmet need technology. My pleasure. It's a pleasure having you.